Alright, what's up everybody? I bought my 30th level 10 with tournament token transfers, which really balanced concept by the way. I did indeed buy Snowman. Uh, was there really any reason for this? Not really. Past few level 10s I've pretty much just been guessing, or not guessing, picking randomly. There is no like correlation uh, or reason as to why I buy them. I just kind of do. Because you know, I know I'm going to max the shop eventually, so I may as well just like randomly buy them, right? I do wonder which one is going to be the last one, though. I don't know. I may as well, like, buy Snowman, right? It's been so long since, uh, you know, Snowman came out. I remember Snowman came out in the uh, winter pack or whatever. It was like a winter holiday thing, and basically it was like 30 bucks, and if you bought it, you got Snowman. Holy fuck, that was stupid. Yeah, I love that guy. He toggles pretty good. Love him, love him, love him, love him. But yeah, I thought I could take this uh, opportunity as a little video. I know I don't record much Blitz content anymore directly, like gameplay. Last time I tried to stream, it didn't really go so well, but you know, that's okay. That's all right. What I wanted to talk about is um, kind of nerfs that are really needed in the game. And I also wanted to talk about how Sir Hunt is like a really, really, really shitty Hypixel player council member for Blitz. And I genuinely think that he should be replaced uh, by somebody in the community. Now, I'm not going to start off by saying like, oh, it should totally be me. But I don't know. It's just the things that he adds into this game are just stupid. It's just pure retardation. And I've been talking a lot with like, you know, Mason and a couple people in the community recently. And like, they all agree and when I mean a couple, I mean like dozens. Everyone agrees that Sir Hunt is just not good for this game. He's just really bad at what he does. Like, he even admitted that when he removed Chaos. That was a terrible idea. Like, why are we letting this guy update our game, you know? He barely takes community suggestions, and when he does, it's because he is out of ideas because he is bad at making things for this game. And I like, I mean, nothing personal against the guy. Like, he's cool. But I just don't think he's good at it anymore. Mmm, cringe. You're gonna lose that in a couple seconds anyway, man. Come on. Let's go. Yes! Now I can have two gapples. That is literally the only reason why I wanted to kill him that bad. Two gapples, bro. Alright, let's get this person. Let's get this person. But yeah, I'll continue my tangent in a in a quick sec here. Yeah, but, like, you know, he added something like Donkey Tamer. Donkey Tamer gives you everything that you could even want in a game just by right-clicking. And then right-clicking again. Like, the saddle automatically goes onto the kit. And, you know, my kit tier list, I did put it fifth, but that is because how can you rate a, a kit that's RNG any higher than fifth, you know? Like, it's not like I'm going to put it first or anything. All right, thanks, man. I really appreciate you cheating on me. Awesome. Peace. Fuck you. Um, yeah, toxicity. Got it. Ha 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 ha. But um, yeah, I just don't think that he's really good at what he does anymore. Uh, I just think that there should be someone else on the team, you know. And I talked with Mason about this, like Mason, like the IGN Mason, not Majestic Walrus. And he said that Sir Hunt pretty much just kind of hogs the spotlight, you know, like. Mason has some pretty good ideas, and Sir Hunt just kind of overshadows them with his own, like, loud opinion, I guess you might say. This whore is cheating on me. You're really fucking cool. Holy slut. This is why I don't go melee kits, by the way. You see me having to bow her? Like, th this is the same thing as just going archer. Literally. <laughs> the same result. Except for I would have just started bowing her sooner. Um, yeah, but... I don't know. I mean, he added Donkey Tamer, and Donkey Tamer overshadows, like, literally, like, a lot of the kits in the game, and it's just, like, really stupid that it's in the game in general, and it's just, like, not a good idea. There you go. Snowman 10 gameplay. Easy clap. I just wanted to keep this video, like, super short and sweet, but yeah, Donkey Tamer overshadows literally every single kit in the game. It just depends on what you get. It all depends on what you get.
you need to remove having a flame bow because you can have a flame bow. You need to remove the fact that you can have a fire aspect sword with full uses. You need to remove that it can have diamond swords, and you need to remove that it can have diamond armor. If anything, if it gets any diamond pieces, it should be like boots. That's it. That's all you should give it. And nerf the armor. You know? Like, if it's going to be an RNG kit, why does it already get half iron and a stone sword? I don't understand. I do not understand why this kit is so powerful. And then you have Ranger, which is literally just the deathmatch bow. You get power one and punch two, except for the deathmatch bow from like 2015, 2016, was power two, punch two. It's the same thing. It's almost the same thing. And, you know, you have Phoenix, that the flame just doesn't belong in Blitz. A flame bow does not belong. It just doesn't. It just doesn't. It's just stupid. Every kit that was added except for Warrior is just retarded. Warrior is the only kit that was added that is, like, seemingly balanced. And even then, Warrior is kind of wonky. Like, why would you add a combination of Hunter and Baker? Right? You know? I don't know. I just feel like he keeps adding kits like in the more updates we get you know the worse it's gonna get i don't know why we're sticking to this formula where we add four kits why do four kits need to be added every single update that's not it's been like that for three updates now that add kits it's been four 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 how about just add one kit and a couple of maps you know god damn I just feel like this game is getting to be so ridiculous, you know? Since Prestige 2s were added, it just feels like this game is so extensive. It used to be so simple. There were like 26 kits or something, and it was levels 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. There wasn't Prestige 1, Prestige 2, and like, I know I'm an old player, and I sound like a fucking 90-year-old man right now reminiscing about the old days, but I don't know, I just feel like Blitz is having too much added, and I thought I would never say that because, you know, I like that the game is getting so much attention, but yikes. Like, if you want to make it comfortable for newer players, sure, but, like, stop adding stuff like Prestige 1 and 2. Are you kidding me? And he's thinking about adding Prestige 3. It's just not a good idea. And Sir Hunt's just a fucking egomaniac, so obviously he thinks that everything that he adds is good for the game, but it just isn't. It's not good for the game. <laughs> I don't know how many times I have to say that. God, well, you know, Snowman 10, 30 10s, I'm about to have uh, the whole shop maxed, actually. 10 more level 10s, 10 million more coins. That is if Sir Hunt doesn't add any more, you know, retarded-ass kits. I'm assuming he would keep adding ultimate kits, so I guess that doesn't really bother me too much. But, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys agree on the points I made, and uh, if you do, give me your opinion on uh, what you think should be added to Blitz or what should be removed, actually. Even though nothing's ever going to get removed because, again, Sir Hunt is an emo egomaniac, but whatever. See you around!